Futter Hype had something to say about Chronicler. If you ever talk, you talk straight enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I talk all things crunch. It's look like he had tried to rope me in a while. No, me now, me now rope me in a while. Go on, talk, man. Talk, man. So, I agree with you that Futter Hype is wrong to say that. But at the end of the day, a Futter Mount. You can look for the numbers in there. You can Google it too, you know, boss. You can't say that. No, we don't call him a madman. But if somebody ever says something that is grossly false and insane, no, no insanity to that, brother. First but it's not relevant, brother. Like, all right, but is that keeping them relevant? Never tell relevant. No, no, it's not keeping them relevant. Because first of all, that does a bit, that does a cause. All right, you see, give and everything needs to be conflict. Controversy, make your bus fast, make your topical, make your act, make your trending. But if there is no real talent behind the controversy, no you cannot maintain it and get no longevity in it, brother. Hey guys, welcome to the group chat. Now, I know you guys kind of used to seeing Gia here, but once again, you're stuck with me. You get me? Um, I have an amazing guest today. You see me? You've probably seen him before all over the internet. You've heard him on your radio stations now, because, you know, he's, he's here. But Triple, what's going on? There, no, my brother. You see me? You're looking healthy, man. Yeah, I try to stay alive, you know? A case you used to go? 40 scattered, 7 yep. months, protest, <laughs> brave me fall, but never heal. Uh, I saw it from the rap. I saw it from the rap when you drove in, you see me? Mm -hmm. uh, I went to Calabar myself still, so. Eh, none of we can't perfect. All of we can't perfect. Wow, Some of it, that's crazy. That's crazy. Bar, you know? I had the same thought when, uh, when I saw the rap still. You yeah, I know. I feel kind of insufficient and inadequate, but one of them things, you can't aspire to be better. We just started, huh? No. We just start, bro. No, but that's what I can say. It's not that bad. You start off wrong, but I mean, people buck them too sometime and catch back them step on. You understand? You know, them them organize yeah, themselves, right? Life not done. You understand? Start yeah. off a life kind of frig up still, but all them things there, you see me? Well, we come here for talk the things them, you see me? You've, uh, when I first met you at least, I met you doing comedy. No, first of all, I never knew comedy was like a thing in Jamaica because overseas, you of course, know, man. you had a hole in the walls and I saw you at Johnny's place, you know, you yeah. big up Johnny's place because amazing talent. Yeah, man, open big up mics, to Johnny daily. You see me? You and, understand me? I said one of them man that really and truly uh, create the, 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 the um, platform for a mm. lot of Jamaican Comedy, comedies, comedy, comics, yeah. for expound upon them talent and put them um, artistry out there so people can see it. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. But mm -hmm. I had a question though because when I went there, I, I enjoyed like the whole festivities of it. I saw some new open mic persons. I saw mm -hmm. some people like coming to the... They're trying their material out now. Mm -hmm. But is comedy dead in Jamaica? No, sir. You're mad, man. Every Tuesday night, down at Jan um, Johnny's place. You understand? It's out, it's out by... Um, by that boulevard area yeah boulevard area there, so over dr don robin side there, so you understand right round up at spray fitness there where Kurt dino the curve used to the first round the same man no she's not around there anymore no she's not there she had a lot now and yeah. you know say um you know say slightly an age inch that a duft and shepherd theme thing to him a theme comedy thing to him. i think he mm -hmm. do it once a month and uh, curly do fit um theme thing down and mobile as well I have all the political comedy pop-ups all yeah, over the place. Yeah, but those are just pop-ups, though. It feel like it dead to me because... No, you know, and I say dead, you know. It's... I mean, look up, look upon Oliver Samuels. You get me? When mm. I was growing up, I lived overseas when I was younger, mm. but I knew Oliver because comedy at the time, it was, it was kicking in Jamaica. You I'm going to tell you what I'm going now. I'm going to tell you what I'm going now. The thing is that a lot of persons who say they're comedians yeah. are taking on the man mantra of comedian, mm -hmm. They are they they have deviated from what originally would be comedian. Is a and 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 it's just that it has moved from the stage itself to mm -hmm. by your phone. Because most persons are are most you have a lot of content creators who are comedians, are comedians as well. Yes, yeah. you know? so it's like there's not really much spaces where somebody can go figure actually say live stand up comedy, but. Comedy, they are said to you, man. Only for you, they are doing the I mean, if you, go, if, you go, if you go and put in the, the influencers like a King Tavi and them, man, they've yeah. really been kicking. But the reason why I say it's kind of dead is because I'm even watching those same kind of people not being able to survive. They have to be doing different kind of things to kind of even make it. Yeah, you but get me? I don't, I don't see an industry out here. Like, well, I might have an MC. You can't say a question. So, I so got say nursing dead then and police dead and teacher dead. I don't see economy, bro. You understand me? Yeah, I say once upon a time. Migrate, but once I'm not upon a time. Later. Hold on. We have talked about once upon a time. We have talked about once upon a time. Mm -hmm. A police could have could have could have taken care of him family, him two pit three pit them. I'm yard. Plus mm -hmm. him have one next woman out of the road with two pit and then one next woman down a country with two pit. But him police salary. Yeah. No, it does things and times just change. Him can barely take mm -hmm. care of himself by himself mm -hmm. with fame salary now. So it's not like say come come 
um, comics are not making money or comedians are not making money. Mm -hmm. But it all depends on your lifestyle. Enough man, lifestyle of them I live is above the means of what they are, what they are earn and what they are create. You but, but you I mentioned said, nursing, but a lot of the persons, even when they get their nursing degree, they literally leave Jamaica. Yeah, but so is it a brain out, drain? It's not a brain drain. It's just that it's to survive on the salaries that of, of yesteryears to say, because you are saying the reason why you say dead is because mm. the man them nah make enough to survive off of that alone. Jamaica is an industry right now where you have to have your job, a side hustle, and a gig. No matter what you do. If you mm. if you do one thing in a Jamaica right now, you go dead for hungry, or you go try, you go live, <laughs> you go basically a scrape through. You understand me? To survive true. in a Jamaica, you have to have multiple streams of income. And that's why I have to big up the man them with on Instagram and social media. We out there I create content and I do several other things and I earn money on them things. All right, but now that you even mentioned that, we could get into some things because personally, I feel like, well, here's a question to you. Do you feel like there's a pandemic on microphones now? Because everybody, as you say, everybody on the internet, you, you, you see me, everybody, I give them opinion now, right? We are even a new show, so I'll call out the elephant. We are a new show. All right, the truth is this. Mm. Right now, more valuable than money in the world right now is clout. Attention. People, people love yeah, attention. Attention is more valuable than money right now. And mm. clout and your name a ring and your name a call is more valuable now. Mm. So a lot of persons, once them, them call, enough people want a little fix, they want a little fix of having a little notary today. For people say, oh, see the youth from, mm. fr 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 from, from, from the link up, see the youth from where, see the youth from, oh, him the pan Instagram, him the pan TikTok, him the pan. YouTube, people want, people love the little notoriety for people to say, oh, recognition. Mm. You understand? And it's different nowadays because like a man like, like yourself, you'd have come from out of town, you get me, you'd have come mm. from country. Mm. People used to come into Kingston to try and make it, is him. They used to come into, uh, into Kingston. A Kingston to... live now, so I'm born and grew a country, but a Kingston live now. You understand? Yeah. But I think that social media has opened up the thing. Exactly. You know, so that no matter where you're in the world, you cannot make money, you cannot, you can't get famous. You don't have to come to Kingston for nobody know you. You have some youth like all Guava. Guava, I don't know bush guava mm. come from, but everybody has watched a guava skit. You Bada understand me? I say Bada Bada cat. Cat. and them people, like, whole heap of people were really and truly are getting notoriety from them there. And the truth of the matter is a double edged sword because same like how people are getting notoriety. Mm. It's the same reason why people are getting notoriety, the same reason why people are running notoriety. You mm. understand me? So the man say, a man get a taste of success from having a name out there and having a platform. Everybody try to jump on it. So it's like it's like somebody got half a tree, got a stoplight. Say, all right, say a man got a stoplight yeah. up a Devon House so, and start mm -hmm. selling flowers. Mm -hmm. And him see a man out there, a man come come see myself flowers and start making money. So him go from riding a bicycle for buy a, for buy a yeng yeng mm. after selling flowers. Go from a yeng yeng Open for buy a Honda Fit. Yeah, go, from, go from a Honda Fit and start drive a BMW after selling flowers. Guess what happened? Yeah, but Everybody going to start selling flowers because over there is the yeah. thing they know. You understand me? I said, no mm. people are going to try to start selling flowers. Same thing. A man says, a man buy two mic and sit down on a city and start talking and race. So guess what? No people are going to get a next city, you get a couple mic. I start give people a chance to so, talk again. So as a person that's been doing this for years, been an MC, you get me? Um, just generally, just been in the public sphere. Is there now a saturation in the market? Because as I said, everybody nowadays have a podcast, have a show, no, have a microphone, have a TikTok, The market have a oversaturated, man. The market oversaturated. But you can't have it still, you know. You have to just, you have to just evolve. You understand? Mm -hmm. You have to just evolve. And just know, say, the cream has always come to the top. You understand me? I say, you always have a flow to the top. Because I noticed that even in music right now, like you would have, there's always this debate over the persons them that are young in music versus the older people. Let me get me the older people them, quote unquote. They always say that they must fight them out. They must fight out the new generation of music X, Y, Z. Do you see what's happening for a person that are influencers? Because you now the influencers, the DJ them and everybody are mixed up in a one. Do you think that as a veteran, for example, as a person that's older, than the younger generation. Because mm. from I know you, you know, you're, <laughs> you're all know. Well, you're, you're all, you're all, all it now. <laughs> you see me, I yeah. young you. But mm. when you see this new generation coming and they're misguided, do you find that there is like a disconnect that is always causing issues? Maybe it's a mindset thing, maybe it's a value thing, maybe it's a moral thing. Do you think that there's a disconnect? When it, I, I think I think it's, it's, it's a blend of two. You understand? Mm -hmm. I feel like it have a little bit of, um, like a man would have looked on it and say, I'm gonna try water down him, water down where him have to work so hard, mm. forget. And then there's also sometimes a little bit of jealousy playing I too. 
because a man see how hard he had to work to get to where he got him reach. All of the do them was shut for them all, like disrespect them all, like sacrifice them, him have to do for reach up out him reach. And then a man does sit and just jump up and overnight, boop. Mm. Reach people that compare him to the same man who work 40 years for getting and you would sitting one week and a man mm. go compare it to him. It it, it go make a man feel uncomfortable. It's only natural. You understand? It's only natural because remember say everybody have ego, you know, and nothing remember artists, you know. Mm. An artist's work, whether it be draw, whether it be content creator, whether it be video videographer, whether it mm. be a cameraman, whether it be be a um a DJ, a selector, you know matter. His work is his baby. I'm child that him have to nurture it for growing, mm. for mold it, for rich where it is. So, for your man, I go look for you and tell you, say, you're, 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 what, you, what you have done and what you spend all of your life accurate. Mm -hmm. A man come just to it, so, boop, and a man go compare. Which is what I'm about to say to. because. It, it, a man I go feel that way about it. Say, there, there's a famous saying that says, it took me 10 years to become an overnight success. Mm. Like, I know a lot of the media outlets and a lot of the news outlets, I consider them archaic in my mm. own view. Right, because they stuck to the same formula that they've been doing for years, thinking mm. that they will carry them through the years. Mm. Now you have a new generation of people stepping in, right? Mm. Shooting things in higher quality, not as PG, you get me? More of what the people actually want to hear, more of the, more that, more that kind of content. Mm. However, no, personally, I feel like it's getting a bit dicey because, as I said before, the, the influencers are starting to mix with the DJ them. I start to mix with the party promoter them. So before, I might not keep a party XYZ, but now that man have a podcast. And because everybody are friend and some people are enemy, those two, those two always link together. I will give you an example. Um, I used to be a music producer, right? I used to produce for a lot of these artists and mm -hmm. I used to sell rhythm. When I went into the studio, I started to notice how the game really worked. A lot of the same musicians are par with the DJ them. And then people are par with the party promoter them, which is how a lot of these artists bust. Mm -hmm. So my question to you is, are you seeing that there's now a collective of the same? Of course, everybody I go pick them side. I say, you know, line I go draw anyway, take it, you know. You mm. understand? It's just natural evolution. Like-minded individuals are gonna, gonna stick together. Lion I go stick with lion. Donkey I go stick with donkey. Goat I go stick with goat. You understand me? I say, I just say, go. people I go always draw to kinfolk. You understand mm. me? I say, so you, you can't bash that. You have to just evolve around it. You have to just work with it. I just saw life stay. Let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. Remember this. You say the man will complain the most. And the man will always complain, he mm. never ever move forward. You mm. understand me? I say? And moving forward is not be, is, is measured on who you are and where you are. Because you can be a man and me see you yourself. And you out the sun, you are drive a teeter. Mm -hmm. You understand? And I see an next man with an X6. But mm. you have, mo have moved further forward by accomplishing your teeter. Than the man who have a X6. You mm -hmm. understand me? I say? Because you might come from somewhere where nobody in your family ever drove any at all. Yeah. You understand? You're probably the first person in your family to buy a bicycle. And they move from a bicycle to buy a Yang Yang. You move from a Yang Yang to buy a B13. Move from a B13 mm -hmm. to a poly shape. Move from a poly shape to, 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 to a Tila. Mm -hmm. You understand? Zin? So the amount of steps you reach, take for reach this up. You have moved and you have grown and evolved to there. While a man might born in a rich family and mm. his birthday and his mother just buy him or his father buy him an X6. Mm. You understand me, I say? Yeah. See, so he hasn't really moved anywhere and he hasn't really accomplished anything. He just inherited something. So, yeah. so it's not like, say, you go watch the growth of a man and compare him to where the next man I do and say, all right, that man is better off than that man, the other man is better than that man. So you have to look upon the facts, say. Some man I got us in the circles for it work for them while the next man I got us work for it. So you just have to come out and just say, yeah, I'm not going to complain, I'm not going to vex, I'm just going to do what I can do and just for reach up and want to reach. I'm reason with you. What I have noticed personally is that, because when I was going to school, there was a lot of things that were different. When I was in high school, enough things get burned out. You get mm -hmm. me? Things where, first of all, a war them would have go on in a school in my time. Mm -hmm. Them look a war here while going right now have nothing in comparison. You get mm -hmm. me? Them, them a little... How are you graduated from Calabar? No, I never graduated from Calabar. I went to Calabar for a while and then I switched over to um, O3S High School. You get me? All right. What, what year? What year? What, what oh, I, do remember that. I do remember that. I do remember. What? 10 years ago? So... Uh, 2013. 
something like that, something like that. So about 2030, yeah. you would have graduated. Yeah, I understand. You understand? That. Okay, all right. So, but the war them, because I, you see me, I was, I, when I came into school, I was like a nerd, because I come from overseas, and I said, you see me? Mm -hmm. But, may I tell you, so the values that I saw. So, when I, when I posed the question to you a while ago about the new influencers that are coming in, the new MCs, the new DJ them, because we're going to talk about the DJ them, but first, more on deal with this party. Mm -hmm. I noticed that there is a change in morals, and I think that is where the disconnect is. You see me? And I, we're going to talk about the things then. No, so, I'm going to mention it. I'm going to mention it. You see me? There was a popular party that kept over the weekend, right? Very mm -hmm. popular party. Now, when persons were, when, when, before the party happened, there was like a controversy in the week. So, I talk about all things. If you ever talk, you talk straight enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I talk all things current. It's like you actually wrote me now. I like no, I'm not wrote me now. Go on, talk, man. Talk, man. So, what I've noticed is you are a very controversial guy. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's because of your morals or I don't because, because of the morals of, I guess, the older generation, right? Mm -hmm. Because DJs have forever had this debate. Mm -hmm. Now, Futter Hype had something to say about Chronicler. Mm -hmm. That part they may deal with right now. Yeah. Now, after Chronicler did not perform at the Jeffrey um, mm -hmm. and DJ Mac Bashment uh, mm -hmm. event, it's like a little mix-up. Do you think Chronicler was even there because Futter Hype is saying that, yo, big up Chronicler for not performing, but... I saw a video where Jay Frey said, yo, um, it's because of the police them why Chronic Law didn't perform. All right. You see a snap of Chronic Law at the party? I don't know. Let <laughs> <laughs> no, me ask you a question. I'm just going to ask. No. You see, you're not saying no snap. No. You're not saying no video footage. Mm -mm. In a 2024. Valiant was there though. Hold well, on. Me ask, no, I'm not saying no. Mm. I, I didn't bestie. So what I say is, is um, yeah. um, you see any snap at all with, 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 with Labas? No. I saw two right. of his songs play. And the party did ram, you know, the party ram. I was there, the party I was there. Gone. See, the party ram. Me never did it still. The party ram. And every single person there. So if, let us say, let us say, yeah. let us say, hypothetically speaking, mm. that there were 10,000 people at the venue. Mm -hmm. Would us I use our own figure, right? It's a 10,000 people. And the average, the average person of 1.3 phone. The average person of 1.3 cell phone. Right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Because yeah, that's that the statistic in Jamaica <laughs> right now. No, the average one male stable, adult no, have one point three cell phone per person. You can Google it. Mm. So out of the 10,000 person today, at least thir at least 13,000 cell phones today. And do remember that the majority of party goers have a phone with mm. at least two <laughs> to four camera. cameras on the yeah, back. Man. So we are looking at 13,000 multiplied by 2. Yeah, we are looking at about 20, <laughs> you, you, you about 26. Well, I know 26,000 yeah, cameras in a one venue. And you are telling me out of the 26,000 cameras in a one venue, you have a point still. there has not been a glimpse or a farthing of the person in question that was at the event. But then the only... I don't say nothing. I just, just try to put it. Because you see me, I believe in the numbers, you know, brother. I would have said mathematics. We were using mathematics of the situation. Mm. Zin, I am not saying whether or not he was there. I am just saying, where's the evidence? But my thing is, my thing is, all right. So, let's say he wasn't there, right? Mm -hmm. I have seen other veteran artists like Ayoptin. Mm -hmm. When I looked on that post that Futter Hype made, I saw Ayoptin reply saying, big up one law boss and thing. So, my, my, that's where my question now draws. You get me? Because personally, personally, I have only met Jay a couple of times. I personally don't care what another man have to do in his personal true. life. Every you man, see me? Every man have to live them life. Them yeah, man. It, you know? and do your to, thing. And the truth of the matter is, let me say Sam, let me clarify something. Yeah, man. Zin, because there is no, I have no, no um, ill feeling. There's no bad blood from my side towards mm. that gentleman. Mm. You understand? We attended the same school and I honestly believe, you see me, me, I fought this myself for life. You know that. You understand? Mm. Fourth is me say, for life. You have some people that have no loyalty and them still not own a claim to North Street, but me is a youth. But any, any opportunity me get, mm. I said, so I'm a big up my school, I'm a represent for my school straight up. Mm. And just out of the camaraderie that is shared from there, mm -hmm. I would never, you understand, say anything to put that gentleman willingly in disrepute. You understand me, I mm. say? So, I'll, but, but, but the facts are still the facts. Wait, but are they you understand? Not, my, my, the the conversation. No. Well, conver what, what, what? I'm going to get to that, you know. What happened and what the gentleman said. If the man said, stand up and wait, him, say, him, stand up and wait, him, say. Now, the truth of the matter is, what somebody chose to do with them own life is mm. for them business. Now, 
We also have to understand, even though it is your business, what it is that you want to do, you have to understand. When you put things out in the public, it is subject to public scrutiny. You understand? I remember mm -hmm. you, when you have a program that is basically exposing your views and your opinion, mm -hmm. you have to understand that people are going to exp expose their views and their opinions. But I think you. See, there, there's something wrong in that though, because even though he had his own personal view, once again, it, whatever Jay wants to do with him life, a theme mm. life, right? If he want to come on in front of a camera and speak about what he wants to do, uh, have an honest conversation with somebody, so be it. I still, I still think there is something wrong with what Futter Hype did. You get me? I'm not really sure. I, I, off the top of my head, I don't remember what the beef between them is. But here's where I think Futter Hype went wrong. And this is just my take on the matter. You socially and you in the public eye try to pressure. I Because I look at it like pressure. You put it out there on the web. Man, a man for the yeah, man. Foolishness that I think that was foolish because... That. But if, if, remember, if this is what Jay wants remember, this is what Jay wants I don't think that was wrong. And if you remember, I say... You have people out there who are just professional objectors, you know. Mm. That is who foot hype you know, is. A, <laughs> foot hype is a Polarizing. professional agitator, you know. That are yeah. out, that, that, are that man's space. Him just object for the sake of objecting sometimes, you know. Mm. You understand me? I say, foot hype is a youth, I'm a rate, I'm a respect, you know. Irrespective mm -hmm. of however, you know. Because some people feel like once you say something in objection to somebody, you mm. don't respect them. And that is bullshit. Mm. I respect Futter Hype because of who he is and what he have done for music and all them someday. But there's a lot of things that he says that I totally disagree with. Now, just I, like Jay, I, I and, respect and, Jay, but I disagree with a lot of things and he says. I understand where Futter is coming from, but I think that the way that he proceeded was wrong. He should exactly. not have came out and said that. He should. And, and yeah. at the end of the day, same way like how we are going to say Jay can't say anything where he wants to say about himself. Futa can't say anything he want about him views, but, but at, even though him, we can, him can't say him want to say, it is up to we now to say that we disagree with how he did it. And exactly, because if that's his Futa Hype's view on something, brother, mm -hmm. I have no problem with Futa coming out and saying, yo, listen, I don't agree with this. I don't, this does not represent our culture, whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. Those are discussions that have always been had. However, and as me said, this is um, another man view on something, right? If that's what he or how he wants to live in life, sure. But the moment you try to Take food out of that man. For example, I'm a father, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I have my daughter. Me have my own thing I go on in my yard. But at the end of the day, the money I make and the food I make, guess who I got inherited? And my daughter. So the moment a man, the moment me sit down on camera and, and display my views and another man say, yo, don't come to my event. Don't put money in my pocket. Don't do anything like that. That mm -hmm. is wrong. And I vehemently disagree with that. You get me? May and, I disagree with and that. I, and I'm artillery. saying this because I but disagree with do, a lot of the views of Dave. Do, but even though I disagree with him, Mm. Me can't tell the man who have to say and what not to say because you see that something you when you social media, mm -hmm. it has given everybody a, a voice. The good, the bad, and the indifferent. And the moment when we start to censor people mm -hmm. and tell them not to say that, at the moment when we start censor, we say no, 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 no. Well, maybe I won't say don't because everybody now got agreed with what you said to your brother. And that's true. That's and true. It's a slippery slope. You climb up the center. Yeah, so when you go up that slope, they have to go say, all right, boom. Because you not agree with it, him not to say it. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Go. When you say a man, a man not to say something because you don't agree with it or because you disagree, what are going to stop a man from saying you not to say something just because you disagree with it? All right, so let me, let me put my premise Let me put my argument real clear, real, mm -hmm. real clear before I move on. Yeah. There is nothing wrong with having a difference in moral value or cultural mm -hmm. value or anything like that. Because, for example, when my, if I had a girlfriend and, and when she go a carnival mm -hmm. and she wants to dance upon other man, that is a big, big, big no-no for me. You get yeah. me? Because I come mm -hmm. from a very different culture. Yeah. If this is how another man wants to live him life, if you disagree with that lifestyle, sure. But the moment it moves from do not support this person because of his lifestyle, that is something that they will be fighting now. It is wrong. That it, it is wrong. I will get and up I and I will say that, that it is wrong. I agree that it is wrong. But at the end of the day, me agree say it wrong, but me can't tell a man not to say where more have to say. You understand? That is all me I try to say. All right, no problem. I, we can mm -hmm. agree. We can agree with that point. I, I can't really say yo. Because enough things me say. Enough things me say. Enough things me say. All the things me say where people say me wrong to say it. Mm -hmm. But me all heartedly believe say me right. And if somebody will come censor me, that mm -hmm. I will have a problem with. So let's flip the coin though. Let's flip mm -hmm. the coin though because. Personally, right? Mm. I've seen how hard you work. As I said, I met you at a comedy club. Mm. I saw when you got on stage in front of a I small... Ask man. Ask it, is, well, is it you got me. But my, thing, party, my thing was, you got in front of, a, I think it was like maybe 40, 50 people there. And mm. when I saw you working, you were working like there was 
20,000 people in the crowd, right? Yeah. You give your energy. What I want to ask you about now is know you're on radio, mm -hmm. right? Know you're over at a certain radio station. I don't know if I can say it, but... Yeah, man, I can say it. Nationwide. Yeah, nationwide. nationwide, nationwide man. Big, big, up, big up Cliff Hughes. You understand me? Yeah, I'm man. Saying? So, you know, you've now had that opportunity and you're working with that. Yeah, I'm mean, get the opportunity there because um, I think... I think uh, um, I've, I've been here still, I don't know what truth it is still, you know. Say it was refused or it was discarded and made us scrape up the rubbish and turn the rubbish in a treasure, I guess. That's um, why I want to flip the coin. Yeah, go because on, as I said, I don't agree with everything. Yeah. You get me? So I taught me, I taught the things them, come on, find out what really go on. So now to me, mm -hmm. here's where I think Jay is wrong, yeah. right? Because what I heard, what I saw come out of him mouth is, yeah. yo, you only get this opportunity because him recommend you and X, Y, Z. No, I thought that was wrong. Let me tell you why I think that was wrong. Mm -hmm. First of all, because it, another well, man, mm. an, another man trashes another man treasure. Mm. As far as I concerned, that's basically like saying, "Yo, a man this my wife because him the devil with her and things never work out." I can't tell you something, brother. Go on. I can't show my drawing. You see me? The man always say, "When puss can get a grip, he mm. say sour." You understand? May I go show you something? I work a nationwide from twenty nineteen. Mm -hmm. No, like, last, last year, what? 2013, boy, I made it gone. 2013. No. 2023. 20, 2023? Yeah, man. So? 2024. Yeah. Yeah. It gone. 2023. Last year, 2023. Zin, January 2023. So one year, mm. I'm much me, I wrote this now. Zin, we mm. get that job there. You see the position that was there? You understand? Mm. Think about, no, think about this. Think about this. Mm -hmm. The show that they called me for, mm -hmm. the show was called Triple T's. Mm -hmm. That was the name of the show, you know. Mm -hmm. Triple T's. That was the name of the show. That was the show where it was conceptualized as mm -hmm. Triple T's. What's my name? <laughs> Triple X. Triple X, right? Yeah, man. Triple X, right? What is Jay's, Jay's name? Jeffrey. Jeffrey, mm -hmm. right? Where T there? <laughs> there was yeah, supposed yeah. to be two other hosts for the show. Mm -hmm. The other hosts, them named T and T. I don't need to call them names because they never get the work and they never, or whatever negotiations never work out. Mm. See? And this was conceptualized from, from before a certain mm. personality left the station. You understand? I don't need to get into them something. Mm. But I can tell you this straight. I don't know who tell this, because I'm not saying that somebody never tell him that, you know, mm. because it would be ridiculous to think that somebody would pull something like that out of thin air. So obviously somebody misinformed him. And I don't, I don't, I don't think it's a lie Hold on, either, hold on, yeah. hold on. No, I'm not telling you that. I am telling you it's a lie. I'm not telling you straight it's a lie. I'm telling you unequivocally, unequivocally that it's a yeah. lie. Not no gossip. Mm -hmm. Not not all no gossip. You understand me, I say? Zane? And this is not me trying to toot my own arm or whatever. But pre this, 2019, last year, mm. just go up and Google and Google them on the 2019. Where part in career did there? It wasn't, it, I think Jay blew up up oh, during no, the pandemic. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, man. Oh, no, man. What party did they? How oh, 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 viable or how oh, credible would it have been? What is the dynamics of his interview style? How does he interact with persons who are not of that, of in our socioeconomic structure, or in our age group, or our age dynamic? Think about, oh, no, think about the, 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 the media conglomerate that that program is. And the, mm. the, the audience base that they cater to. Me going on that show would be pushing the envelope. As you said, you saw me in a settings that is mm. outside of street or dance. I saw me at a comedic show, right? Mm. And, the, and what would you say would be the average age group of the persons that were there that you saw me? Well, I mean, I was there, so I saw you people was probably from... the youngest person there. Yeah, but... As I... a big people thing. Exactly. And a big corporate big people thing. So mm. when somebody is going to create a show for... Daytime radio for somebody for, for a, a program to cater to because if we think about the viewership, it's a much nation, older, it's the older it's person, a, like right? It's a more mature, to, you understand? Yeah. Yes, they are trying to incorporate a younger dynamic, but you still mm. have to cater to the dynamic that is there. Now, when we talk about, we have, we have a talk about, can, as I tell us, I believe in numbers and I believe in facts. You know, you see, anything we attack, you're supposed to come back it with facts mm -hmm. and numbers. Now, I'm not telling you that probably who was trying to because at that point. He was being sought after by a certain managerial team. And mm. I don't know if the managerial team had told him about this venture. Mm. And he could have been a part of the venture. I don't know if they tried to sweeten the pot and tell him that this was for him or created for him. 
but he was never, ever, ever mm -hmm. thought about for this program. If he has any form of product, obviously. So you're saying that the entire on, thing, hold on, the hold entire on, thing was hold a lie. On, hold on. If he was approached for this, he would have an email. So you're hold saying on, that hold on, hold on, hold on. He would have an email from Nationwide 90 FM with the header, the official letterhead, saying that he would be invited to a meeting, to a sit down, or to invite his, his managerial team to speak. No, he needs to. If that was if that was the case, being the person that he is knowing, 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 Show knowing, the no, 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 knowing his affinity to screenshots and posting them, don't you feel that would have been posted by now? I am just saying. I'm just trying to use the mathematical and try to quantify this thing, you know, because I believe mm. in logistics and I believe in statistics and I believe in whenever somebody put a trail of activity, you're supposed to can walk around. Alright, so I have a question for you. If on. Jeffrey right now can come out and show you those receipts, would you re, re I recant? Would, I would. I would recant and I would apologize with the most sincerity and to everybody <laughs> because as a as a grown adult, <laughs> you're you're supposed, you are supposed to say that you're wrong when you're wrong. And I have no problem to say. But how the relationship got sour? You were just on his show. I don't understand. And 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 also there are a lot of other claims that were made that I was I was boosted into relevance by a program that when I went on it, it was aver averaging about four thousand views per show. <laughs> I was the one who I think if we're supposed to really and truly. But you have to give him his props. Hold on, hold on, props, hold on, hold on. If we were supposed to really and truly think about it, the first viral moment. That was given to that show was supposed to be credited by this big bumble wall right here. Mm -hmm. No, so no, so you can't look for the numbers in you can't google it to you know, numbers. You no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not disagreeing with you. All right, so mm -hmm. here's another question then because I don't want to just keep it on Jay, right? Because, um, personally, I used that. It's not coming. No, 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 no. Well, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. But mm -hmm. my, my question now is the polarizing figureheads, right? People deem you as polarizing, people deem Jay as polarizing. People deal, um, deem even walk and talk as polarizing. Wait, wait. I, you can't, you can't, people deal narrow as polarized. I don't want to just keep it on the Jay Free and yeah. walk and talk because even walk and talk is a friend right, of the show. Let me tell you what, you what, what, what polarizing is. Me walk, all right, first of all, as I'm telling you, I say, me and Jay not have nothing. Him say some things, and you notice I have never, I, from him say what him say, but I said, son, I said, I can sometimes, let me tell you something. You say, if you argue with a madman, I make no sense in a brother. You understand? You, you understand? can't say that, nothing with him, call him a madman. But if somebody ever says something that is grossly false and insane, no, no insanity that, brother. Talk it truth. And the good thing, but yet me live very near to Bellevue, so I know mad people, you know, brother. Me do, when me do my practical, when me go, you take it. I'm I, 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 over Bellevue, me did go. And go do, go, go do my internship, you, you know. You so just a game ammunition. You just a game ammunition. Well, like but me a game ammunition for a, one thing about me, you know. You say anything at all, me do. It out there in the public, you know. You mm. say what you see with that youth, yeah, is what you get. So, I have never exposed one belief and went anywhere else and 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 try to even devi deviate or or have never succumbed to any form of pressure whether internal or external mm -hmm. to set so and deviate from what it is my true belief so is, is it the polarizing um is it the the controversy controversy that sells because as i said you have narrow right the fixed major um let me tell you what people like people like people like honesty people like realness people like things that them can predict you understand? Mm -hmm. And you have to remember this. When somebody can predict, because there, there are different types of predictions, you know. You can mm -hmm. predict somebody, say, say, if somebody weak, you can predict, say, they're going to fall. If somebody, if somebody is a kiss ass, you can predict, say, they're going to kiss ass. If, you, if, if, somebody, if you have somebody as strong, contrite, and to the point, you can predict that. That is what you expect for the person. People like honesty, and people like realism. Is there longevity so, in that? Of course. Once you stick to who you are. Brother, look for my career. Look at my career. Mm. I have never not been working. I have never <laughs> yeah, not true, been true, relevant. True. I have never ever not been relevant from my career start. Mm -hmm. Because I'm real and I stick to who me is. You understand? Mm -hmm. And what I do is what me, me do what I do because it is what, what you see is what you get. I don't have to play a role. But that's what I'm part. saying. A lot of persons look on the Nara and the Jeffrey as they, they get what they're getting. I'm ask they you get a question. Jay, um, Nara, has Nara changed from inception? No, no, no. From from the first time when you know Nara, if you go up on the fix from na, from Nara Marga and look like in time dog on lamp aisle. <laughs> when him up on um where, where, where station ended up on the first time? Um but but in um you take this when he was um yeah. when he just starting up. Yeah, when him just I don't remember, I don't remember. Back in the time, the man when you could have seen. 
the Morgan Hispanic man, when him look never few, they said them time. They know man and I say few. Them just never in the testosterone never start pumping them body. So they never really get that muscle mass the way you have, you know. See? So if you look pan narrow from them time there, up until now, have you seen any deviation or alteration in the person? You see a little bit of maturity and growth, but is the same nonchalant, contrite to the point person that you see. The same person where you see. So is from is is, is the relevant right? because you know in, in, in dance hall, right? You always have one faction against, go against the other, right? You mm. always have one DJ a clash against the other. What I have noticed, right? Now you have these media hosts openly for like one of the first What's it not relevant, brother? Like, all right, but is that so. keeping them relevant? Never tell relevant. You, no, no, it not keep no relevance. Because first of all, that does a bit, that does a cause. All right, you see, and everything need, need conflict. Mm -hmm. And everything need conflict, brother. You have something when you when, when, when you growth of harmony. You understand mm -hmm. me? I say you have something named synergistic development. You understand me? I say you don't have to be parasitic for 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 grow. You understand? You have something named symbiosis. You understand mm -hmm. me? I say symbiosis is when different entities work together to grow. You understand me? I say mm -hmm. and in an entertainment, the only way entertainment can grow properly is through symbiosis, brother. Because you see, anything that is parasitic, the parasite has to be removed from the host at some point in time. You know? but that, and when the parasite melts with the host, when sometime when you remove the parasite from the host, both the parasite and the host dies. But then that's my point because there is already a division in my view in dancehall. I know that persons like, for example, the JFR have started to host events, right? Mm -hmm. Which is why I deem that there is a problem. That's why I never agree with foot hype with that because if jay Frey is now hosting a part when i went to that party you know i know a lot of the industry leaders in these events you know mm -hmm. i know a lot of the persons that are keeping on me not call a name but we know some of those persons my question is no when you're saying chronic law don't go there you are putting pressure on these people mm -hmm. you get me and these people they, they're all friends you're now creating a divide that even the audience even the regular viewers and party goes, brother, they don't brother, how deep brother, it goes i am not saying that you're you're, you're wrong enough to say foot type is wrong i mean i agree with you that foot type is wrong to say that you know but at the end of the day you're foot amount that is what foot I get paid for do, brother, for talk. I feel thing, brother. I'm a fifth. I'm not like that. I'm not like that. All right. Fight all all right. It comes like, right. come like you have an evangelist pastor. Yeah. See? And the pastor has to preach to theme, theme congregation. He has to set some beat Bible and he has to shout and scream out. Then you have a Catholic pastor. The Catholic pastor has to hum and talk to theme things, subdued and calm because he has to preach to theme base. Foot as base is, the, is, is what you call. The the, the, the the hardcore where would I call people them call dance hall realists are the dance hall purists mm -hmm. that are theme base. You must have to preach to theme base. Say hello, the man for preach to theme base. You can't this are the, all right, I'm showing you something. People. Mm -hmm. I mean I'm gonna say this straight up. People, not because you don't agree with somebody, not because somebody says something that you don't agree with. That does not automatically mean you and the person are enemy. You understand? Feel like the thing enemy. is this, Feel like everybody just have... No, brother. If, if you feel that, deeper, if you... If that, you... bro, I can tell you. I know who are my enemy in this, in this business. I know exactly who are my enemy. And I can guarantee you, the fix most definitely is not my enemy. Um, Jeffrey is most definitely not my enemy. He's inconsequential to me. You understand me? I say, walk and talk. Worse, walk and talk. And I'm, a, and I'm an enemy. Footer mm. hype is not my enemy. None of them people, no, no media house, no other conglomerate is not my enemy because at the end of the day, whatsoever it them do, nah go stop me from make my money. And whatsoever I do, nah go stop them, them from make them money. Footer hype say what I'm saying and come out and make a big elevator statement. Did that stop Jeffrey from ramming the venue and making the money anyway? I have a different theory about that. But eh? I'm not going. Is that First part, of all, the venue look like you could not hold nobody else. No man, it when, when, the right. the when La when La Bas co never come at the show or never perform at the show, anybody get a refund for their money? No man, no man. The, the, as I said, I enjoy the party personally. All right I was then. There. Okay. Saying, well, so what, what I am the, saying is what I am saying is this, bro. What I am saying is this, bro. We need to stop this division thing, your brother. In a, you see, you see, That's if the artist them want war. It a entertainment. Yeah, man. man, leave that to them. That's the vlogger. Crowd, no need for a war, brother. Exactly. Vloggers. So, Vloggers and podcasters, we are here to expose our views and exactly. give our takes and something. It got mixed my up when, take, when them well start mixed. My take does not have to be your take and your take does not have to be my take. We're supposed to be civil to understand so we can agree to disagree, brother. The problem is not for them money. Uh, you say most of them when they vlog, I'm going to tell you the truth. Them money come like foreign ganja. Them growing a horse. <laughs> 
them don't know what out of the world look like, them don't know what street look like, them don't know what world look like. So you see, True. because them grow underneath them mother, well, we don't want to say it, and it's so... And them have strong opinions. Them man, they, it's not say them have strong opinions. They do not understand what is out there, what the elements are. So any farm, a little breeze blow up and they, them think, them panic and do that. You remember, you remember when you look up and watch one cartoon, with, with a little fall, with a little fall, then with a ball, but say, with, say, 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 sky a drop in her head. Chicken a little. Chicken, chicken little. little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand me, I say? When you set so when them man there, any little thing will look like any little pressure reach them. Oh my god, the sky is falling, the sky is falling. That, that boy I want to kill me more war. Me, nobody know want war, your brother. Nobody know business boy, your All brother. Right. So here's my last few sets of questions before mm -hmm. we go. Do new because persons are watching this, right? Mm -hmm. They've seen the J Fairy rise, and I don't think J Fairy was just around the other day. Isn't it? That's why I said. How long time far J come from? Is that same as North? You have to, you have to exactly. the man also. The man so, do it from the vlogging days and come. You have to appreciate yeah, so, respect a, a man also. So my question is, um, he was around before, but mm -hmm. he never popular. Do I wouldn't no, say nothing. He was not popular. He did popular and him vlog them. You know, yeah. and he, he make a transition yeah. over into into podcasting now. So, so not, and then he, he, he might gain success from that as so well. So my question is, to the young persons watching, the persons that they want to start a production, they want to have a show, that, do you need to be controversial to pop? Do you need controversy no. at all? To create good content that no. Jamaicans want. No, you don't. I, 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 I'm going tell you something about controversy. Because, I mean, I'm gonna tell you was it Pretty Dan or Pretty Pretty? Pretty Dan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty Dan is a I never heard job. about her until then. Well, that are you, brother. Because, no, as no, you say, I'm, as I'm you say you're a nerd, brother. Yeah, I'm so, out of the loop. So, I'm out of the loop. I stay out of this. I stay out of this. I you say it and I mean say it. I'm just use back a man. I was a full nerd in university. So, so, so. So, get your love, boy. Yeah, No, man. Everything cool. I'm not saying I forget the fence, bro. What I say is this. When, 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 when some people have different, everybody have for them own format, have for them own style. Pretty Dan is a shock jock. She says things, the most outlandish things mm -hmm. to evoke controversial thought and to get people to laugh and people to see a difference. She uses a lot of similes, metaphors, and analogies. Me tell people, you know, a lot of persons look at loudness and brushness and vulgarness as dunceness. Me tell people, what do you do have a life? I tell people, I say, Pretty Dan is an extremely intense intelligent and extremely articulate woman when we said so boom i pray people choose different ways of doing this who not have a show right now you understand mm -hmm. when we say my little pretty brown friend i host and them thing there. big up gia Zee, gia 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 no need like people like them they don't need controversy for boss you understand let me tell you something you have to understand this you have several different ways of bossing you see when people believe what you say, you have a be, be, and, and I believe say, you see controversy make your boss fast. Controversy make your boss fast, make your topical, make your act, make your trending. But if there's no real talent behind the controversy, no you cannot maintain it and get no longevity in it, brother. You see, me believe the people them, you see, slow burn until them reach the top of the best mm -hmm. way that for boss because guess what? You develop a loyal following. You get a, fan a loyal following, a loyal fan base. You get people who are going to be hardcore and dear, dear one and grassroots supporters. You see, my career, my career never. A lot of persons know, get, know me from controversy. But remember, I tell you, a far me I come from another something. So, irrespective of that, number one, the truth of the matter is you have a lot of persons who might be more popular on social media. But you're in me. the streets, though. You're in but the you see, when though. it comes to day to day activity, I am one of the most. Notable or not, 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 noted person in a Jamaican entertainment. I am a household name. Mm. You understand? The average Jamaican know who I am. You understand mm. me? I say, Zane, mm. the average Jamaican know who I am and know what it is that I expose. You understand me? I say, now, like, when people see me, they know, say, oh, that boy, the him, now nah, the man has female, you can't re, re, re. him, I go talk him, mind. People know that, and people, and the thing when I tell people this, Everybody can say it, you know, cause everybody, and I agree with you wholeheartedly, because mm. sometimes even me, myself, thinks I chat too much. Enough of the time, I look for myself and I say, dog, you know, you chat too much, brother, you know, you're going to get yourself in a problem. But what nobody at all can ever say about me, nobody. You never lie. We never tell a lie yet, brother. Nobody can say so. Nobody can come and say so and look for myself and say, you know, say I lie triple X to that, say. Mm. I might say something that I wasn't not as much as informed about. So but my, if so I get corrected, I will, I will, I will admit that I'm, I'm wrong. Yeah. Zin, but I am not going to come here and blatantly come out and come tell lie or create no false rationale or no false story. 
mm. if come get no credibility. So we now come try to come cloud chase off on nobody, mm. or if come jump up. We have to remember this, you know. Longevity is not about being the artist. And that's how enough man if you understand. Mm. It's not about being the artist. It's not about being at the top. It's about maintaining enough momentum so that you can carry to the trajectory where you want to go. That is what this thing, you know. This is how we are the writers in the entertainment. They have no retirement plan, bro. Unless you have to take out sit down a surgery core or mm. one of them life insurance places eh, where you got to show a, a, a retirement scheme. There is mm. no retirement plan. There is no NIS now. Either NIS or NIS. So you have to ensure that so you maintain this as long as you possibly can. You mm. understand? And one of the things them where make we as vloggers and social commentators relevant or keeps us relevant, it is our credibility. You understand yeah. what I say? So speaking about that, um, one of my last questions, or my last question to you is, you know, personally, we talk, so I, I kind of know one or two things that you have coming up, things that you know you're building, because as you say, you're in the streets, you get me? Yeah. A long time ago, you know, at Nationwide, in, a, in that particular role, in that particular show, what can people expect to see from you? Because we know you have your lives, then we know you have different things doing, but you have anything else that's coming out? Coming soon to a show near you, to a place near you. Always booked, always busy. You mm -hmm. understand me? I say, um, you know, we can't really to, to say certain and certain things because legal ramifications of certain things allow us not mm -hmm. don't allow us to say certain and certain things. Even though them try to come from podcast, come bant on me and try to get the people to fling me out of them country. Mm -hmm. But that's not gonna work. Zane. But coming soon to a city near you all over the world with this. So. You understand? We have all mm -hmm. of our shows coming up in Jamaica. You understand? Um just look, just come on, we don't need to set some mm -hmm. self propagate or self promote. You understand? What yeah, you see man. is what you get. You understand me, I say? See? Yeah, man, yeah, man. But once again, brother, respect for coming through. Ah. One, one thing I, I'll say before I, I wrap up the show is when I when I call your phone mm. to Ford, a lot of people them will send you to their manager. Them will send mm. you all over. Them will send you all around the world and ask for I'll all tell kind of things. Tell me, I Big up to my management team. Um, <laughs> Effort, marketing. You see me? Yeah. Caris, big up yourself. You understand me, I say? But it's all me believe in. I'm going to tell you something. Enough man to understand. You see, sometimes, sometimes you have to each one teach one. Because you, mm. you don't know what is going to happen in the future. Mm. You understand me? I say, you, see, you see what it is. You see, real talent, yeah, mm. I bro. And you have to understand this. You don't have a young podcast at start right now. Mm. You understand? When anybody calls me for a podcast, rather, you see, a man will have a podcast that is undeveloped or not reach the forefront. Me rather go this up than go to the place where a man have him thing on a trajectory because more, more time when a man have him thing on a trajectory it have an ulterior motive mm -hmm. you understand when a man call me where a man try to come try to come use me as clickbait or try to come steer me in a direction where me probably and true, really and truly want to go and when a man already have a platform in platform already set a certain way him have a tendency to try to edit things to give the rationale what him want mm -hmm. you understand me I say so when I said so go to a new and developing podcast, you can speak freely because mm. when a new and developing podcast, I'm gonna know where him show I go. You have a direction for your show, but you know where party it go. So you try to let, let in as much of the original content as possible mm. so people can hear your views. Well, I always one thing I like about the culture is that we have different shows here and persons come on, they are able to speak their mind. Me personally, I'm just a person that like for no while go on. You mm. get me? I'm not really in the streets, them I I'm not a party person, I'm not really any of that, right? But because I'm in the culture now, because I'm in the know, I try to understand what's really going on. And the things that I see, I'll just speak up against it, right? Mm. So I hope you don't think I have an ulterior no, 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 <laughs> motive. But but if, me? If, 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 trust me, you see me, one thing about me, I'm one of them man away. I believe in a walking in the valley of the shadow of death. You're not back from nobody. You understand? Mm. Zin, because the good thing about it, you said my mother sent me to school. Yes, I did go there for the lunch money. Yes, yes, yes. But for me to get more lunch money, I had mm. to get good grades. You yeah, understand? So, I try to ensure that I absorb as much as I can. So, when you said so, and this is me I told my own hand, when you understand yourself and you know yourself and you accept yourself for who you are, mm -hmm. people can't really twist you, know, bro, and turn you. Know. People can mm -hmm. try to create for them own narrative, but when you set and stand 10 toes down, mm -hmm. you can set and navigate and, and go anywhere you want the person to go. See? All right, man. But once again, man, thank you very much you for coming yourself, through. Bro. Before we end the, um, end the show, I just wanted to give a Big, big up to all of our sponsors, you get me? I'm not your resident host, G, as you have every single week. However, so if I miss out a sponsor, you know, don't, don't, don't crucify me, you get me? But I want to thank M1 Productions, making sure the set is always lit. 
I want to thank the bar because you've always provided us with a wonderful venue. I want to talk to thank Worthy Park because the spirits are always on deck, you see me? I want to thank Dax Productions, making sure that we have the crisp quality when they come onto the camera. I want to thank Candy Closet. Um, they always make sure the girl them look good. And you know what's that when I love to see the girl them. I want to thank Commercial Concepts. I want to thank Jeremy Duncan Photography. And last but not least, I want to thank History. But before that, before we leave, the bridge, you're always making sure I'm looking good. So big up the bridge, big up our fans then, big up our followers then. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you follow the page, Culture Outlet. This has been the group chat. Big up once again. You see me? And we'll catch you on the next one.